Well, as we creep closer to Christmas, bargain hunters are already turning their attention to the looming discounts and deals to be had on Boxing Day. Now, to find out how you can get the biggest savings, I'm joined by shopping expert Lorica Clark. Good afternoon to you, Lorica. Hi, Amber. Look, it seems the sales have arrived early. This, you know, there's sales 30% off here, 25% off already. Is it even worth braving the Boxing Day sales? It really is. Probably not worth braving the actual sales, but to go online from the comfort of your living room is probably a really good idea. You can get up to like 80% off across many, many stores uh, this Boxing Day. Like everything's just going crazy. And uh, But if you want to really avoid the madness, you do pretty much stay out of those horrible car parks and all the traffic and uh, <laughs> you know, stay home and do it from the comfort of your own lounge. So you're saying online is the way to go? Online is really the way to go. Uh, we did a survey at Cash Rewards, uh, cashrewards.com.au, and we surveyed over a thousand people. And uh, you know, 30% of them are now doing their shopping online. They prefer it, and around 50%, the survey showed they prefer going to store still, but also do go online. So that's just showing a trend now towards people finding, you know, it's more comfortable to do it from home, obviously, and also you can do more of a research search on, on everything to see who is offering the best sales, especially on sale days. But also when you do go to cashback sites like Cash Rewards, you can also get extra savings on top of that, which then gets back into your bank account in the form of cash. So you're getting a bigger you know, saving on top of the savings you're already getting. Okay, any last minute tips to make the most of those post-Christmas bargains? Well look, social media is a really good one to keep an eye out for because you're following all your favourites anyway and they'll put out some special saving coupons or things that, that they're going to be offering and throwing out on sale days like Boxing Day. Also other ones are all those gift cards that you've kept in your drawer. That's a really good day to redeem those because you're going to get more bang for your buck on a day like that and uh, also you know just keep an eye out for what you know, is trending and seeing you know keep and keeping things in like your shopping basket when you do shop online because sometimes they stay there for a couple of days and so when you get up in the morning on boxing day you can go straight to your trolley and go exit now you know and uh, it'll all be there and maybe they've added some extra savings on top of that already and you'll get an extra bang for your buck. Some so great advice. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. Thanks for having me.